Hello, and welcome to a new episode. Today we will talk about religion and what the word really means. I go now to the dictionary definition of a religion. This is not the one that has been held by the majority of the atheists. A specific fundamental sets of beliefs and practices general agreed up by a number of people or sects. By this definition, so I am always say all forms of people's actions are a kind of religion. Monotheistic is the belief that there is only one God. One God has all powerful, all wise, all beneficent, all merciful, and all good. This the chi elements of the Christian religion of Islam of Judaism and other such kinds of religion. Then we have theism. This mean basically uh, all forms of religions how have have one or more gods. Um, or it's the majority of the time there are more gods like Hinduism um, Jainism I think Buddhism some close of Buddhism have gods but the majority of them don't worship deities Buddha was actually against the belief in deities, Siddhartha. His perception, so far right now, was that there was not so much a god-like person, and you have many uh, levels of existence, but you don't have truly gods. If you can understand what I mean with that. Then you have atheism. Atheists do not believe in a god. That's what it be. And that is uh, the point. Atheists think they have no religion. But I find pretty absurd. Actually. Because religion is a specific a fundamental beliefs or practice generally accepted by a group of people or sect. By uh, placing themselves out of religions they are also placing Taoism out of religion and Buddhism because the majority of the schools of Buddhism don't believe in a god and Taoists and Confucianists also believe not in a god Shintoists believe uh, not in a traditional form of uh, gods. Uh, Shintos believe more in one more nature formed of uh, gods. They don't believe in gods in uh, a Western sense. Maybe there are uh, find an um, other term for them also. Maybe that can be put in in theism. Yes, I th uh, there. Are, Absolute sure, a group of theists, um, but not in the Western form of that. I believe in one personal God or something like that, or gods. 
our more belief in spirits. Yep. But my definition of a religion, actually anything, what people do is religion. Like the saying goes, the man have done his work religion. Religion come from the word religio, which means actually one bound. You can say it one connection. So anything people do can be seen as a kind of religion. And there's not so much bad with religion necessarily. You have good religions and bad religions. That's the reason that one in its one time, um, actually, um, the cultures begun to call religions they don't like uh, cults. For example, um, the Greeks called uh, Pythagoras a cult. They called Jesus Christ a cult leader. Um, Mohammed was also a cult leader or he become an organized religion in the eyes of the states and the emperors and empires around them. I'd be so clear with all the political games people like to play. The theists, the atheists. I know atheists don't like it when somebody calls uh, out that there are actually religion. There don't been a religion in traditional western sense like um, some um, atheist uh, last told me that he believed that religion is uh, believing in uh, God. But that's what a weird weirdo. No. If you look to the word religio, so I, I say, then the more realistic definition of religion um, is um, Pacific. Uh, fundamental beliefs or practice uh, general accepted by one group of people or sect so a sect is a schisma of um, older religion back like, um, Christianity is a, is a schisma of uh, and breaking from the Catholic uh, Church and from the uh, from the other churches, and then we have all the weird kinds of uh, Christmas from the from all the other religions, from the Christianity, from uh, Islam, from uh, Judaism, and also you have a lot of different forms of Hinduism. I hope you find this video enlightened. Forget not to question authority. Think rational and forget not. When darkness and light become one, the reality is split away and the truth become visible. As long as man will be the ruthless destroyer of other living beings, he will not find help or peace. Indeed, who say the sage of murder and hate will not find help or peace. Carnism is a cruel religion because carnism caused suffering to other living beings. It is an arrogant belief system. And arrogant ideology that convinces people that there, it is okay to pick and choose to be to be kind and to which to be kind be kind to dogs be kind to cats but not to pigs and not to cows be kind to guinea pigs being kind to your pets but screw the turkeys not that of our species. If you was thinking about that.